So hello everyone once again welcome back to my channel JBR online classes and in this video I'm going to start exercise 16.2 for 16.1 please check the description box the link will be there so here the first problem find the area of each of the following parallelograms so here first you have to know the formula to find out the area of the parallelogram and here the formula is it's a very easy formula base into height of that parallelogram okay so here for the first problem sum number one here in the parallelogram here base equal to 8 centimeter height equal to 4.5 okay so that means here 8 into 4.5 will be the area of that parallelogram and that one equal to 36 centimeter square next one Next one here the perpendicular is the dotted line because here that is one is 90 degree. So that means 4.4 is the height and the base equal to here 2 centimeter. So 2 into 4.4. Okay. 2 into 4.4 it's 8.8 .8 centimeter square as the area. Last one here 2.5 is the base and 3.5 is the height. Okay. So, area equal to here 8.75 centimeter square. It's a very easy problem. Okay. Now, move on to the next one. Next one here, sum number 2. In sum number 2, here you have to find out the area of each of the triangles. So, the formula to find out the area that is half into base into height. Okay. This one is the formula. To find out the area of the triangle so here first one here half base equal to here 6.4 and height equal to 6 to cancel out with this 6 so here 3 3 into 6.4 it's 19.2 centimeter square as the area number 2 half into base into height here base equal to 5, height equal to 6. To cancel out 5, it's 15. 3 fives are 15 centimeter square as your answer. Now the last one, half here base equal to 4.5 and height equal to 6. So 2, 3, then again 4.5 into 3, 13.5 centimeter square as your area. Okay. Uh, so next one, some number 3. It's a very easy. Sum number 3. Find the missing values, base, height and area of the parallelogram. So, for the area of the parallelogram, you know that base into height. Here, 7.5 into 5.6. So, that will be 42. Sum number 1. It's 42 centimeter square. Next one. Sum number 2. You know the base. You also know the area. So, to find out the height, it will be area by base. So, area equal to 246 divided by 20. Okay. That one equal to 12.3 as your height. Next, number 3. Number 3, you have to find out base. So, base equal to area by height. Area equal to 154.5 divided by 15. Okay. That one equal to 10.5. 3 centimeter last one number 4 again here you have to find out the base here area equal to 48.72 divided by height 8.4 okay 48.72 divided by 8.4 that one equal to 5.8 centimeter now the next one some number 4 in some number 4 here base height given find out the area of the triangle so area of the triangle half into base 23.2 into height 16.7 so 23.2 divided by 2 that one equal to 11.6 11.6 multiply with 16.7 and your answer is 193.72 centimeter square next one some number two 
here you know the base find out the height so half into base into height that one equal to 87 so here h equal to 87 into 2 by 15 okay as here 2 divided in the left hand side so move into right hand side it will be multiplication and 15 here multiplication so it will be divide so now 87 into 2 it's 174 so 174 divided by 15 here 11.6 your second answer third one third one here half into again base 22 and here height it's h so 170.5 so here h equal to 170.5 it's 2 by 22 to cancel out this one it's 11 so 170.5 divided by 11 your answer is 15.5 millimeter okay 15.5 millimeter now next one and the last one number four number four here half into you don't know the base so half into b into here height equal to 31.4 and 1256 is the area so base equal to 1256 then 2 by 31.4 so 1256 divided 31.4 that one equal to here 40 now 40 into 2 80 so 80 centimeter is your answer now next one sum number 5 in the adjoining figure abcd is a parallelogram whose two adjacent sides are 6 centimeter and 4 centimeter if the height of the corresponding to the base AB, that one equal to 3 cm, the area of the parallelogram. So, here the area of the parallelogram ABCD, you know base into height. Here base equal to 6 and height equal to 3. So, here 6, 3 is a 18. Okay, 18 cm square. Now, the next thing, find out the height corresponding to the base AD. Now, again, Suppose here AD is the base and then height will be, suppose this one here E point, so here CE is the height, okay? And here you have to find out the value of CE. So if AD is the base, CE is the height, that will be also the area of the same parallelogram ABCD. And that will be here 18 because you know the area. So, here AD equal to 4. So, 4 into CE equal to 18. So, CE equal to 18 by 4. And that one equal to 4.5 centimeter. That will be your answer. Next one, sum number 6. In the adjoining figure, ABC is an isosceles triangle. So, two sides are equal. Here AB equal to AC, that one equal to 7.5 centimeter. BC equal to 9 centimeter. Okay, base BC equal to 9 centimeter. If the height AD from A to C, so here AD is the height that is 6 centimeter, then find the area of the triangle. So area of the triangle half into base 9 into height. So here 3. So, 27 centimeter square, your first answer. Then number 2, the height CE from C to AB. Now, in that case, if AB is the base, so 7.5 and CE will be the height of the same triangle. So, that means this one will be 27 because here also ABC. So, now CE equal to 27 into 2 divided by 7.5 so 27 into 54 54 divided by 7.5 that one equal to 7.2 centimeter okay 7.2 centimeter that is your answer now next one sum number 7 and this is the last sum for this video so guys if you like my video please please share this video and please subscribe my channel okay so here sum number 7 if the base of a right angle triangle, so this one a right angle triangle, here base equal to 8 and hypotenuse equal to 17, then find out its area. 
so to find out the area first here you have to find out the height of this triangle now by pythagoras theorem there is a relation between height base and hypotenuse that one equal to hypotenuse square is equal to height square plus base square okay so here hypotenuse square means 17 square you have to find out the value of the height and base square here 8 square so 17 square 17 into 17 okay that one equal to 289 and here 8 square in the right hand side so 8 square means 64 so subtract 64 from 289 so it will be 522 so 255 is the height square then height equal to just square root it so root over 225 and it's 15 centimeter so 15 centimeter is the height so area equal to half into base into height so it's 15 not 25 centimeter square that is the area so to cancel out this 4 so 60 centimeter square that is your area